you ready? Sorry, Sorry guys. Ready. We have closer Andrew Walters and recent graduate of the University of Miami. We'll go straight into questions for Walt. And Andrew. Oh God. Well, um, we're always a I'm always asking you about pitching. Now I'm going to ask you about your hitting on this team. Um, yeah, can you talk about that, all the home run hitters and how much they've provided for, for you guys? Yeah, I mean, we want to swing the bat here. And we got a lot of power this year from the weight room. And glad to see the home runs, you know, provided for our team. How, how much does that obviously help a pitcher? It's huge. I mean, it's, it's, a, it's a thing you can't defend. So anytime we get a home run, I mean, it's a big part of the game, especially in the games we play in the ACC. And each home run is huge. It allows us, you know, get the upper edge and take over the, you know, that side of the game. Is that maybe why, and I haven't counted actually, but probably you haven't had as many opportunities for saves? Yeah, I mean, we, we, we take advantage of big hits and big opportunities, and home runs have been a part of that. You know, big, big three-run home runs, two-run home runs, or contribute to the run production, and whether or not it's a safe situation, it helps our team out huge. And the last thing is, could, just can you talk about your season, how it's gone, and uh, after that, something about this weekend, this weekend series? Yeah, I mean, I feel like I've been having a great season. Come out there and, you know, as a closer, come out there and shut the game down for my team. That's what I try to do day in and day out. And I leave what happened in the past in the past and focus on the games ahead. Well, what's, what's it like coming down the stretch here, senior? Things coming uh, down the stretch, what's it like for you? It's fun. I mean, you know, it's a great team. We get to play great in the ACC. And, I mean, as a senior, I feel like the same as it was last year. I mean, I don't, I don't even think about that kind of that kind of thing. I'm just another guy on this team. Here to help them out, you know, be a great teammate, and just go out there and win ball games with the guys. Having said that, Gino said that the main thing he wants you guys to focus on is to remember how last year finished, and, and to finish strong going into the ACC tournament and the regions. Yeah, we all felt that, and uh, it was tough. It kind of left a bitter taste in our mouth, and I guarantee you, we're all thinking about it, even though we we take it game by game. But we're definitely not going to let that happen again, and for sure. So uh, excited to see what's to come. Having said that. How big is this series going into the uh, ACC tournament? It's huge, huge. Every series is huge, no matter who we're playing, no matter who the rankings is or whatever, and it's, it's, it's big. We've got a last home series against a good team, and you know, we like to play well at home. And it's good. I can't wait to see the fans out here, and uh, yeah, we're excited to play this game. Well, sure. what, is, what is the importance, because Gino mentions it, but for you as a player, what's the importance of you playing your best baseball? at the end, as opposed to, he said last year you guys peaked like in the middle of the season and then going into it. What's the difference? I mean, I feel like we just kind of lost energy to be at back half of last season. Played great throughout the year, and then, you know, we just kind of hit a dead spot. This year I feel like we've been slowly rising. And I feel like we feel great, we feel energetic coming into the last part of the season, and I feel like we can make a run at it for sure. You've pitched a, a few more innings per game this season. How has that helped with your development? It's been good. I've been able to throw a lot more pitches and uh, work on my off speed a lot more, which I did in the fall. And uh, I mean, whatever my team needs before, whether it's three innings, two innings, one inning, I'm going out there to get it done. So, uh, yeah, I mean, getting stretched out is great. Um, how different is it once you get into the ACC tournament? That whole the way it's set up, and how, how different is that for pitchers for the whole team? It's a little different because you know the preparation kind of isn't the same and uh, we play multiple games within throughout you know a week or so and it's a little bit different play at how the the rest is and all that but as a team we just focus on one game at a time so whether it's a different day doesn't matter we're gonna figure out a way to get that game done how important is the ACC tournament in relation to you guys you know, maybe hosting a regional or whatever I, mean, I feel like every game is important now it's, it's the end of the season you, know, you wanna you wanna finish out strong, you wanna win games, so whether it's this last home series of the ACC tournament, we just wanna go in there and win ball games. How have you felt about the way that your off speed pitch has to go up this season? I feel great. I mean I got to throw them a lot and especially going off last year, the way you know guys would attack the fastball and especially coming to this year gonna change their approach a little bit. Being able to throw that off speed has really helped me out good. You guys are about to have a lot of national media coverage going to ACC's and What's one thing that people from across the country in college baseball need to know about this Miami team? There's a lot they need to know. I mean, it's, it's a very resilient team. Whether they look at our stats, what we have on the mound, says nothing, honestly. We go out there and play hard every single day. And it's one of those kind of teams you, you don't want to think, think low of for sure. Because however they think of us, we're going out there, we're playing hard, playing really hard. And 
especially at home. Love to play at home. But it's one of those teams that's resilient. No matter down nine, up nine, we're going to play the game we've played all year. The, uh, the senior day, I guess, last day of the season, what, what's that like for somebody like you? It's important. I mean, it was very important for my family to see me graduate here. You know, they've all graduated with bachelor's degrees from college, be able to be able to do that, especially continue the legacy here at the U. That's been, you know, in my family for a long time. It's huge. So yeah, it's gonna be an important day for sure. What again? What's your degree in? Sorry. Uh, business administration. Business business administration. Okay. Last weekend, you gave up a, a run. Um, you know, not very common, I guess, for you. Um, when that happened. What's the mentality shift that happens in you to kind of close a game out? Yeah, I gave up. I gave up those. Uh, I think it was a big hit in the ninth, actually, or the eighth. Yeah, I scored a couple runs. I mean, honestly, I just played pitch by pitch. I wasn't really thinking to give up a hit there. And you know, the next guy, he's lucky he didn't hit it out because after that, I wasn't getting up nothing for sure. But honestly, just going out there, taking pitch by pitch, and doing what I did all year. Kind of just that lockdown mentality coming after you with all you got, making you swing the bat and getting the job done. And a couple what, more. For yeah, more. Well, has your body changed at all this season from when we talked in the beginning, you know, with the weight training or whatever? Has anything changed? Your weight, your fat percentage, whatever? No, no, no. Stay pretty true. I haven't lost any weight. I didn't know that. Got, got strong in the weight room like we do all year. Continue to lift, continue to improve, you know, athletic performance all the way through. So, what's your, what's your height and weight now again? 6'4, uh, 222. Got a couple big saves on the road, and for this team, it took you a while to win a game on the road in ACC play. But to close the season, win your last three road series. What was the shift that this team had from the struggles on the road in the first half to how you finished in the second? I think it was just you know adjusting to to going on road trips. Though you know those long those long bus rides, the plane rides, all that kind of that kind of downtime. We had to just figure out you know kind of mimic what it feels like to be here at home with all that rest, all that energy the fans and it was big big to turn around and you know get those games done and channel that throughout the dugout and able to you know come out on the road and win games like we do here at home. Anything else? What can you say about this last bullpen uh, and their progression over this season? I mean it's it's big. Bullpen's probably the, always got to be the strength of our team because you know baseball gets tough in the, the seventh eighth and ninth and uh gotten a lot better for sure and we got guys that are stepping up and it's big coming in this last half of the season awesome. thank you thank you thanks Walt. thank you